Hi guys, um, a quick little update on the dishwasher. Um, if you've just bought one and you're not quite sure how to use it, uh, a quick demonstration now. Now, when I open the door, it's going to be dirty because I've just loaded up a few little things. Uh, basically, you get one of these funnel. Uh, this is used to fill your salt up with. Now, <laughs> it's a bit dirty because I've just loaded up with a few little dishes um, for the purpose of the demonstration. Uh, when you first get the dishwasher, um, the salt there, as I've explained before, uh, fill it to the brim. Now, in the manual, it will say fill it up with one to two kilos of salt. Now, this uh, particular model will only hold just over one kilo. So it's best to get two kilo bag um, because it goes slightly over one kilo. Uh, when I first bought the dishwasher, um, I measured one kilo uh, out and I filled it up and it was not quite full. Uh, so it goes over one kilo. But in the manual it is say add one to two kilos, but you can't get two kilos in that. It won't hold it. It's just slightly over one kilo. So you need a two kilo bag uh, to fill this up. Make sure it's brim to the full, brim full with, with salt. Um, for your first use, um, you don't need to wash the dishwasher out at all with anything whatsoever. Um, you just basically slide your drawer in once you've filled it up. And you've got your rinse aid in here fill that up um, till you actually see it overflowing at the top here um, close that don't put any tablet in this is where you put the tablet but don't put any tablet in close the door and whoop, excuse me my back basically you turn it on and i did a quick wash program one so if you turn it on like that um, that's five that's six that's one and then um, you could put it on half load um, and then just press start and it just rinse it out uh, that's all you need to do because once you've put the salt in and if you spilt a little bit of salt you've got to get rid of that little bit of salt you've you've spilt I normally try and pick it out with me with my fingers and then just wipe it with a cloth so there's no residue of salt left so basically for the first time you're using it, just run it on program one, that's what I do. Um, and it takes about 15 minutes. And that's basically rinsed your dishwasher out ready for the first use. Uh, so basically, um, I used the Fairy uh, tablets, but they didn't have any in stock. Uh, you get 37 tablets for fiver. Uh, apparently Tesco's and Asda are selling them, Fairy, and it's a all-in-one tablet. But obviously they didn't have any when I ran out. So I've had to go with, I've had to go with the Asda, but you get 60 of the capsules. Um, this comes in very handy because when you've set the dishwasher for program free or whatever program you have, um, when the when the light comes on on the P4 there program 4 that tells you when it's done so if you open the door to let all the steam out it won't stay open um, so it just goes shut the only way to stay open is if it's right down like that which you don't want it right down like that so if you want it about like that to let all the steam out and the condensation uh, when you've turned it off and it just won't stay so when I've when the dishwasher's finished, I can't do it with one hand. This comes in very handy because there, uh, and that lets all the steam out. And you give it about half an hour uh, to cool down. Then you can empty your dishes and they're both dry. So that's where that comes in very handy. This is what you get free with it uh, to top up the salt. But um, I don't use it. That's the only thing it's used for. Um, I use a jug um, because it's much easier. Uh, fill that up with the salt 
and it's got the little spout there which I can just sprinkle a little bit as much as I need so basically um, let's put the tablet in this old greasy thing this is some dishes I've just cleared away from last night uh, if I can open this with one hand now <coughs> that's the tablet basically it's got like some cling film around it uh, you'll see all the tablets have some sort of cling film around it you don't take that off you leave it on uh, it's the same with all tablets that come in like this little package uh, and just leave it as it is just take the tablet out pop it in there basically it just sits in there and close that that's all done we will <coughs> turn it on there's not very many dishes in there so we're gonna press the half load button uh, I do the program first I want program free that's me program free pressing all that in that's me half load it's now lit up and now press play or start see it's gone to number one so that's to say it's filling up with water now and it basically rinse in the dishes 15 minutes later it had dropped to number two program two to say it's washing the dishes with the tablet uh, the, the, where we just put the tablet in that that flap will open when it gets to program two uh, when it gets to program three it will uh, dry the dishes when it states program four the light comes on that's when it's done you can turn it off and then open the door and that's where that comes in useful to open the door to let all the steam out and the condensation so then your dishes will be dry so that's my quick demonstration you can hear it actually filling up with water this uh, particular model from Curry's will actually use 11 litres of water so it's actually now filling up probably with 11 litres of water so every time you use this dishwasher, it will use 11 litres. So that's what you can hear now, it's filling up. So basically it's on programme one now. Um, you, you set it at programme three so it knows what it's doing. It's just telling you, because there's no other timer on it. Uh, some comments did say there's no timer on it. Well, there is in a way, because that's basically your timer. Um, how long you've got left because you can time each each one about 15 to 20 minutes <coughs> so that's how I actually get it to work so after about 15 minutes you'll see that each light drop down so uh, you can actually stop 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 the dishwasher uh, so if I went like that and turned it off if there's something rattling inside um, you can now open it you can see all the water um, there's not much in there oh that wasn't healthy my glass so we put it a bit like that so if you do hear anything knocking around you can open it um, turn it back on it's still on one look uh, and it started up again so it's quite easy to open the door in an emergency if you need to and, uh, and it just carries on doing its cycle so you can open the door anytime you wish to uh, if you hear the blade knocking around or something like that uh, some people do say it's it's a bit noisy um, maybe on the rinse yeah, as you can hear it now uh, it's a little bit a little bit noisy but as it starts going through the cycles it's it's not too bad but I don't think it's any any noisier than a washing machine um, so basically that's that's my quick quick demonstration uh, always um, turn the dishwasher on on the first use with no dishes in and just give it a cycle uh, to wash it uh, get rid of any residue what's in in the dishwasher itself um, so basically now that will take 
about an hour to wash them dishes. So anyway, thanks for watching and see you soon.